God bless you everyone. Welcome to our Palm Sunday devotional. And what I have is I'm going to be reading from the book of Mark in chapter 21 verses 1 through 11. So this is a little bit of a chunk of scripture um, and feel free to uh, read along with me or just listen. Uh, so Palm Sunday, that's, that's April 5th is today, April 5th. And here we go. And this says from the book of Matthew chapter 21 verse 1 through 11 it says this it says Jesus triumphal entry into Jerusalem and it says when they had come near Jerusalem and had reached it says and when they had come near Jerusalem and had reached Bethpha at the Mount of Olives Jesus sent two disciples saying to them go into the village ahead of you and immediately you will find a donkey tied and a colt with her. Untie them and bring them to me. If anyone says anything to you, just say, say this, the Lord needs them and he will send them immediately. This, this took place to fulfill what had been spoken through the prophets saying, tell the daughter of Zion, look, your king is coming to you, humble and mounted on a donkey and on a colt, the fowl of a donkey. The disciples went and did as Jesus had directed them. They, they brought the donkey and the colt and put their cloaks on them, and he sat on them. A very large crowd spread their cloaks on the road, and others cut branches from the trees and spread them on the road. The crowds that went ahead of him and that followed were shouting, Hosanna to the son of David. Blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest heaven. When he entered Jerusalem, the whole city was in turmoil, asking, Who is this? The crowds were saying, This is the prophet Jesus of Nazareth from Galilee. So we read this passage, and this is the triumphant return. This is Jesus fulfilling prophecy that was laid down centuries before he was even born in a fleshly body. So he is, he is fulfilling prophecy in this time. And in this Palm Sunday season where we begin to celebrate and amp up gearing towards Easter and we start to, to share the story of, of Jesus' final days in a fleshly body on this earth, it is important for us to recognize the season that we are in, the season that we're a part of, that our Lord is not fallen, He is still risen, and He is risen indeed, and He is still walking and working on this earth with us. That He is moving through us through the power of the Holy Spirit. And all we need to do is be willing in these dark times to lift up our hands, to begin to praise and shout, Hosanna! Hosanna in the highest! Thank you, Lord! Glory! Just take those times to be able to be cheerful, to praise the Lord that we have. Hosanna to the Son of David! Blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord! Hosanna in the highest heaven! This is a time where we can be full of cheer and hope. I hope you guys go forward today with a season of hope, with a season of cheer. Be blessed, you guys. I love you, and I hope to connect with you guys real soon. Be feel free to send me a message or anything that you need. If you're dealing with something, I am here for you. Talk to you guys later. Bye.